Yahweh Shai, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai, Barakata Yahweh, Barakata Yahweh Shai. Call Halal Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakar Kadash. And in the ancient Hebrew tongue, that's the name of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, and His begotten Son, our Savior, Yahweh Shai. I want to title this lesson, I'm just going to spirit. Um, I want to title this lesson, Esau will be brought very low very soon. In this kingdom that we're in, we're, we're, you know, living out our last days of our captivity. And in Esau's world, everything is turned upside down. Good is bad and bad is good, so to speak. You know, um, if, if you want to, you know, make it in this kingdom, you have to be like Esau. You know, he wants you to talk like him. He wants you to think like him. You know, um, you, you have to, you know, conform to, to, to his ways, to these heathen ways. To quote unquote fit in, and now you know coming into this truth, we we know that that's not our ways. We know that that's destroyed us in the past, and it's destroyed us here in Babylon. So coming into this truth, this marvelous light, it, it's a blessing to have. You know, to have the Comforter Yahweh Shah sit with us and you know give us these scriptures because without Him we'd be destroyed. You know, I want to go to John chapter eight verse forty four. Ye are of your father, the devil, and the lust of your father ye will do. He was a murderer from the beginning, and abode not in the truth, because there is no truth in him. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is a liar, and the father of it. So since the beginning, um, if you, you understand this in the spirit, but since Cain and Abel, you know, Cain being Esau, he, he reincarnated to Esau, and Abel being Jacob, he, he always was a liar. He, he always, you know, despised uh, 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 Abel, or so, so, you know, so to speak, Jacob, you know, when he presented, um, you know, his gift to Yahweh, it was rejected. And what did he do? He slain his brother, you know, and it's the same thing in this kingdom. You know, they accuse us every day. They want to bring us low. Um, they, you know, they constantly sit on, you know, sit on this thing of pride and they, they, they get comfortable and, you know, and watching us, uh, you know, be, be the be the tail and they be the head. You know, this whole construct of 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 America, you know, which in the Bible is Babylon. It, it, it's based on, uh, you know, everything carnal. And, and once again, we're not, you know, the seed of Jacob. We're not we're not carnal people. We're very spiritual, you know. We've been, you know, since King David, we've been, you know, put in situations to where we have to hearken unto our Lord. And, and that's what we do here in Babylon. You know, uh, Lord willing, the elect and, the, you know, the one thirds that will be saved out of this, you know, I'm, I'm speaking of them. But we, we hearken unto our Lord. You know, two thirds of our people, they've conformed to this world. They, you know, they, they, they trust in this world. They trust in the system. They trust in Esau. And, and, you know, they don't see what's going on. You know, the Lord, he, he blinded them. You know, so coming into this, we understand that Esau, the so-called white man, is the devil. And then he's against, you know, the so-called blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans, which make up the 12 lost tribes of Israel, who were scattered across the four corners of the earth. So, you know, like John 8 and 44 said, you know, they're, they're the father, they're, they are of their father, the devil. You know, they are of that, 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 that seed. You know, just like a serpent, they're very slick with how they speak. You know, they're very sly. They like to, uh, you know, smile in your face. As a matter of fact, I think I have that scripture. You know, but they like to, like I said, they like to smile in your face and, um, uh, you know, uh, a plot against you, you know, when you turn your back. Let me go to Proverbs 10 and 18. He that hideth hatred with lying lips and he that utter a slander is a fool. Uh, this is Proverbs 10 and 21. The lips of the righteous feed many, but fools die for want of wisdom. So going back to Proverbs 10 and 18, you know, they, they hide their they hide their hatred with lying lips. So, you know, you you may you know be in the workplace or, you know, out and about, you know, they give you this fake smile and, you know, they try to have these small conversations with you, you know, just to try to fill you out. You know, these little political conversations, you know, are you a Democrat or Republican? You know, they're just trying to figure you out. You know, they know we are a, a holy nation. They know we are of Yahweh, Yahweh Shai. 
So they just try to, you know, see where we're at because they, they're naturally they're naturally under us. They're naturally afraid of us. So when they're around, you know, so-called black men, so-called Latino, so-called Native American, they usually, uh, you know, they, 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 they become cowards, you know, but they hide behind that pride, thinking that, you know, we're still ignorant, thinking that we don't know what's going on. So they try to, you know, figure us out, like I said, just like a sly snake, you know. Um, let me go to uh, Psalms 58 and verse 3. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. And that's Esau, the so-called white man. As soon as he's born, he goes speaking lies. You know, that's why they have this whole construct of white and black. You know, they're the white man and, and we're the, you know, the black man. You know, when you think of those, you know, those terms, everything white is so-called pure and everything black is, is you know, it's, it's negative. You know, which we understand that that's not true. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, you look at, you know, you go in your bathroom and look at your faucet, it's white. You look at toilet paper, it's white. You know, Esau, he's not white. He's a red Hebrew Edomite. Okay? We're not black. We're, we're, we're different shades of brown. Okay? So, you know, that's once again, that's him going and speaking lies against us. Those are, those are ways that make him feel comfortable. He has to lie. You know, he has to have a system to where materialism is, is you know, the main factor of, of so-called, you know, manhood or uh, so-called, um, you know, uh, who has what, you know, determines your, you know, if you're a good person or not. That's because they hide, they hide behind these things. You know, we're spiritual people. We understand that these are all in vain. And very soon, Jacob's trouble will kick off because, you know, we're seeing the signs right now. But very soon... This will all go away. Everything they have will be brought to nothing, you know. So, you know, we're hearkening unto our Lord. You know, we're 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 you know rejoicing in this in this word. You know, we're we're studying, and Lord willing, we are a part of that number, the the hundred and forty four thousand that'll be saved out of Jacob's trouble and into the kingdom and reign with Yahushai. So, you know, the wicked are estranged from the womb; they go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. And like I said, that's 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 Esau, you know, and the, uh, all the other nations have now, um, you know, molded themselves after Esau because Esau, you know, he looked to be like the most high God, you know, with this fake, uh, you, you know, Jesus, you know, this white man as 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 Yahweh Shai. Um, you know, when you look at, you know, the United Nations, they all come together, all the, you know, the gathering of the nations, they all have on suits like, you know, the white man and, you know. You have to talk, uh, you know, English like the white man, and you know that that those are all constructs that that he made to to be exalted in the earth, you know. But we, like I said, we understand at these times, that, you know, the more we hearken unto our Lord, that the more their kingdom is crumbling. You know, America establishment is crumbling. Their debt is reaching, you know, at this point, I believe it's like seventy-two trillion dollars every second. It goes up. You know, the, their infrastructures in America, they're, they're crumbling, you know, uh, and, and, and their president, he clearly is under the spirit of Yahweh Shai. You know, he's the embodiment of, of, of the so-called white man. You know, he's the most prideful guy <laughs> that, uh, you know, I've seen. Um, so, you know, he's like a talking head for these guys. But, you know, this is all leading up to Jacob's trouble in World War Three, which we understand, you know, that you, there's going to be nuclear bombs that basically... Uh, wipe America off the face of this planet so it's never inhabited again. You know, this place is, is worse than Sodom and Gomorrah. You know, this place will make Sodom and Gomorrah look like, a, a, you know, Sesame Street, so to speak. You know what I mean? So, you know, like I said, we, we, don't, we don't trust in, in Esau's system. We don't trust in him. He's going to be brought, you know, very low very soon, you know. Uh, this is Revelation chapter 12, verse 10. And I heard a loud voice in heaven. Now is come salvation and strength and the kingdom of our God, Yahweh, while Yahweh Shai, and the power of his Hamashiach. For the accuser of our brethren is cast down. Okay? And who's the accuser of our, uh, the accuser of our brethren? That's Esau. Okay? The so-called white man. He's going to be cast down, which accused them before our God day and night. Like I said, he accuses us, you know, day and night. I'm going to give you a prime example. So I'm, uh, I'm actually in school right now, and my school is close to my grandmother's uh, house, so I'm staying with, you know, 
I'm saying over here. And uh, I guess the NFL draft was on last night, and there was a, a, a so-called black man who was drafted last night. Now, he got drafted. He was supposed to go, I guess, higher in the draft. But he got drafted, and when they got drafted, they showed a high school clip of him basically getting into He broke up a fight between him and his sister, and then he kind of jumped in. Okay? This stuff happened when he was 18 years old. I, I believe that guy's like 22 now. But he went to college and everything, got drafted. They didn't show not one clip, not one clip of him, uh, his, his highlights in college. Instead, they wanted to show the clip of, of you know, what happened in high school. You know, that's, that's the, those are the little sly things that Esau does to put in the people's heads that, you know, the so-called black, Latino, and the Native American men are, are evil, you know, we're aggressors, and, and you know, they, they, they try to mold the world into thinking a certain way about us, you know. So the whole time I'm looking, and I'm, you know, of course I'm in the spirit, I'm getting mad, but it, 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 it you know, it, it sat with me, and I was just thinking, I'm like, you know, look at this, He's, that's the serpent, you know. That's what he does. He accuses our brethren every day. You know, this guy gets drafted into the NFL. You go to show a clip from years ago. You know what I mean? Not show none of his collegiate uh, highlight tapes. You know what I mean? So, you know, just just a little example. But, um, you know, that that's that's Esau. You know, he's very slick and he accuses us day and night. You know, if a, if a black man commits the same crime that a white man does, you know, that white man gets, you know, a slap on the wrist. But the so-called black man, he'll, you know, go to jail for years, you know, and be plastered on, you know, every uh, news station, you know, because that's what he saw does. He's, he's very afraid of us. And he has to, like I said, for him to feel comfortable, he has to accuse us, you know. Um, let me uh, let me go to second Edgers, chapter eight, verse 50. For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world. Because they have walked in great pride. Okay, and that goes along with two thirds of our people who are right now who are hearkening unto the Lord, who have heard this word but have rejected it. You know, they follow along with Esau, they follow along with his system, you know, 